In this video, we state and prove Hahn decomposition theorem for sign measure. So first we write down the statement of the theorem. Let x s mu be a signed measure space space then there are measurable subsets a and b of x such that a intersection b is equal to empty comma a union b is equal to x and a is positive set for mu while b is negative set for mu okay uh, now we come on to the proof of this theorem proof uh, without loss of generality we may assume that mu does not take take the value plus infinity otherwise we consider we consider minus okay let lambda to be the supremum of mu of e such that e is a positive set for mu okay we observe that lambda is greater than or equal to 0 less than infinity then there exists a sequence an n is equal to 1 to infinity of positive sets in x such that lambda is equal to limit n tends to infinity mu of n ok <coughs> let a is equal to union n is equal to 1 to infinity a n then a is a positive uh, positive set for mu because you know that uh, you know the countable union of positive set is a positive set so and mu of a is less than or equal to lambda ok we uh, we have a A n disjoint union A minus A n. Okay, and this implies that 
म्यू ऑफ ए इज इक्वल टू म्यू ऑफ ए एन प्लस म्यू ऑफ ए माइनस ए एन ओके सिंस सिंस ए इज ए पॉजिटिव सेट ए इज ए पॉजिटिव सेट एंड each an is a positive set therefore mu of a minus an is greater than or equal to 0 for every n greater than or equal to 1 okay it means mu of a minus mu of an is greater than or equal to 0 for r mu of a is greater than or equal to mu of an for every n greater than or equal to okay uh, it means this implies that mu of a is greater than or equal to lambda and hence lambda is equal to mu of a that is mu of a is equal to limit n tends to infinity mu of a n okay uh uh since lambda is greater than or equal to 0 less than infinity this implies that mu of a is also greater than or equal to 0 less than infinity okay so uh this implies that a is a a is a positive set set for mu now uh, come on to the next part of the theorem let b is equal to x minus a claim that b is a negative set negative set for me okay means our aim is to prove b is negative set okay so suppose uh, uh, on contrary that suppose on contrary that that b is not a negative set for mu then then there exist a measurable subset a measurable subset e of b e of b such that mu of e is greater than 0 okay but mu of e is less than infinity uh, and so zero less than mu of e less than infinity okay then by existence theorem theorem existence theorem for positive set positive set uh, there is a there is a positive set f 
positive that f of e such that mu of f is greater than 0 less than infinity okay now a union f is a positive set is a positive set and a intersection f is equal to empty okay because f is a subset of e and e is a subset of b which is equal to x minus a okay so therefore mu of a union f is equal to mu of a plus mu of f and you know mu of a is lambda so lambda plus mu of f it means uh, this implies that mu of a union f is greater than lambda mu of a union f is greater than lambda it means what happens uh, why this greater than lambda mu, mu of a union f is greater than lambda because uh, your mu of f is positive and lambda is also non-negative number means greater than or equal to 0 less, less than infinity so mu of a union f is lambda which is a contradiction which is a contradiction to the definition of definition of lambda because lambda is the supremum of all the positive set supremum of all the measure of positive sets means mu of e such that e is a positive set of x okay so that lambda is your supremum value so the any uh, positive uh, measure of any positive set need not exceed the value of lambda so this gives a contradiction hence b is a negative set for mu okay and clearly clearly uh, a intersection b is equal to empty a union b is equal to x hence that that is the proof of our theorem now uh, this hand decomposition for signed measure need not be unique okay so first uh, write down a remark uh, the hand decomposition the hand decomposition uh, need not be unique need not be unique okay for a sign measure sign okay now uh, for this for this let uh, x to be your closed interval 0 to 2 pi and mu of e is equal to integral over e sin x dx okay and if you draw the graph of sin x okay that is your uh, that is your 2 pi that value is pi and that value is 0 okay so we have a is a set which is a closed interval 0 to pi and b is your set open from pi and closed from 2 pi this is a uh, hand decomposition of a 
uh, space x with respect to the measure mean and uh, with respect to this measure mu you easily check that a is a positive set and b is a negative set and second uh, if we consider this decomposition again in this decomposition in this decomposition a is your positive set for mu and b is your negative set for and hence we conclude that our Hahn decomposition need not be unique clear so i will stop here in the next uh, theorem uh, we discuss uh, jordan decomposition theorem uh, okay